Trim my leg and kiss my ass goodbye. <laughs> in the paper today and they compared Oakland to New Orleans mm -hmm. and it's uh, I'm inclined to go along with what I read you have the same makeup of people so why should we expect it to be any different I trust the government to do what they've consistently done since um, we've um, been here in America I expect consistency so no I don't expect a lot though <laughs> I think the response to a natural disaster in California would be much faster and much more. In 1989, the Loma Prieta earthquake inflicted serious damage throughout the region. A quake on the Hayward Fault, which runs through the heart of Oakland, will be much worse. This earthquake could exceed the destruction visited on New Orleans, reducing many areas to rubble within minutes and crippling vital infrastructure for years. Even the downtown police headquarters has been deemed structurally unsound. Fires may erupt in urban neighborhoods and in the arid hills, and no water will be available to fight them. Extensive sections of bridges and highways are vulnerable to damage that will render them impassable, cutting Oakland off from the outside world. State officials warn that no help will come for at least 72 hours. The residents of Oakland will be on their own. I think we need to have a city plan. We need to all come together as best we could. The poor areas, the people who don't have nothing, not much. People are living off checks from month to month. Those people, they're gonna be doing without. They're gonna need the help. The earthquake of 1989 did a tremendous amount for people. People have, they're very organized in their neighborhoods. They have neighborhood watches. They've had this earthquake preparedness around here for years, but people don't take it serious. And I think the only thing we can do is prepare ourselves. I don't know if there's a community-wide thing we can do. I haven't heard of anything. Maybe there is. We need that stuff, because that stuff is part of the fabric that holds us all together. And it, as long as it's functioning the way it's intended to be functioning. Palm Island is the major trauma hospital, and I think they're having terrible budget problems. It can never be. I have no idea about how to prepare for a disaster. I don't know what's, what's beyond my realm. Breaking through people's denial about something like that is pretty challenging. I still haven't got a full earthquake kit together for myself. people and they went to church and they, they were really successful and they go to work and they had nice homes and it's all kind of gone you know and that's kind of amazing you know I wanted to go visit or to Mardi Gras or go down there but now it's nothing to go down to it's kind of weird I can't believe it but I think that it, looking at the images on the on the television you can really see you, you keep saying gee that looks like a third world country or it looks like Haiti or that's that's the United States that's the two-class system three-class maybe even. <laughs> 